Hey guys, it's Warren here, and today we are making apple pie. Quite possibly the best dessert ever, plus it's really easy to prepare. So why not make it this year for Thanksgiving around Christmas, or pff, just another regular Wednesday night in? And this is enough to make an apple pie that serves six people. To begin with, take four cooking apples, which is approximately 750 grams, remove the cores and then peel. And now chop up your four apples, preferably into slices or small chunks. Now, with your apples prepared, take a large mixing bowl. Pour the apples into the mixing bowl and then add one teaspoon of ground cinnamon, two tablespoons of plain flour, 125 grams of caster sugar and one teaspoon of lemon juice, which will stop your apples from browning. And now simply mix everything together until the apples are evenly coated in the mixture we just added. And now for the pastry. Flour a clean work surface and roll out between 300 and 350 grams of prepared short crust pastry. And make sure you roll it out big enough to line a 28 centimeter greased pie dish. Place the pastry into the dish, making sure you push it all the way up to the edges. Also make sure you have some overhang all the way around. Now trim off any excess pastry that may be too big around the edges using a sharp knife and you can use this excess pastry to patch up any holes around the pie. Now use a fork to gently prick the base and the sides of the pastry, then pour all your apple filling in. Make sure the filling is evenly distributed leading to a gentle peak in the middle, then brush over a small amount of milk around the edge of the pastry. Now roll out another piece of pastry between 150 and 200 grams and place it over the filling for your pie topping. Again, trim off any excess, then run a fork around the edge of the pie to secure the two pieces of pastry together. Make a few small slits in the top of the pie which will allow air to escape, then brush over some more milk. Finally, sprinkle over a dusting of caster sugar, then place your pie onto a baking tray. Then bake in an oven preheated to 180 degrees centigrade, 350 Fahrenheit, for between 30 and 40 minutes. Keep an eye on it and when the pie is lovely and golden on top, remove it from the oven. And the great thing about apple pie is it can be enjoyed straight away or prepared in advance and reheated later. And when serving, sprinkle over another dusting of caster sugar and this apple pie tastes great with my favourite custard or ice cream. Now, if you loved the look of this apple pie, remember to give this video a thumbs up. Remember also to hit the subscribe button and the bell button, and that will notify you when I upload a new video. And you can check out loads more of my recipes by clicking on one of the videos appearing on the screen.